Hi, my name is Kevin DeRose. I'm a senior chemist here at Gemini Industries. And I'm going to talk a little bit about the way we test the Gulf synthetic panels. The first test that we're going to run on the panel is called cold check resistance. Basically, this is a three stage test that we use uh, at three different temperatures. What we're going to do is run all three stages five times. So we'll have five complete cycles of those three stages. And what we're checking for here is delamination, moisture, and adhesion of the coating on the panel. In the next step of the testing process, we're going to check for water immersion. Basically what that means is we're going to set this panel into a vat of water with a weight on top of it to hold it underneath the water. And we're basically going to leave this like this for four hours. After sitting in the water for four hours, we'll take it out and put it directly into the freezer. And it will sit in the freezer for 16 hours. Now the freezer is set at a constant temperature of 23 degrees Fahrenheit. After sitting in the freezer for 16 hours, we'll remove the panel and place it on the drying rack for four more hours. Then we'll repeat the entire cycle again for the designated amount of days. At the completion of all the test cycles, we're going to check the board for adhesion. Basically just a basic fingernail test. And you can see the deck restore product comes off very easily with the fingernail. Hardly anything at all. The deck over product is a little bit better. It does have some better adhesion up against the fingernail. But by far, the Gulf Synthetic product maintains excellent adhesion after all the cold check testing and freeze thaw and water immersion testing. I really can't even dent it. <laughs>